Today is a special day. Uh, Ate, to sva ščela predelate, ne? Že 15 let nazaj. Te pa mu zaj, mu pa lali te moped, pa ga čez dva tedna vrnemo, čez dva tedna in mu te predelali te motor. Nam zavipaš? Ja. Ok, te pa mu naredili. To. So, today's vlog, we gonna start to rebuild the legendary 20 years old Tomos moped, that's my childhood moped. And I'm gonna show you something that we've been working on for the past six months and it's finally here. So let's go pick up headlands and let's head over to Moto Garage. <music> Morning, Helen. What's up, buddy? Let's go film. Let's go vlog. Give me my camera. Here's your camera. Rock. So did your dad find out that you take his moped? <laughs> yeah, he just came back exactly in the moment when I was doing the intro for the vlog, man. But he's still gonna be surprised when he sees the end. Uh, I custom. hope. I hope. So it's gonna be like pimp my ride. It's gonna be rock on pimp my ride. We're gonna pimp this moped as we know. Okay, let's go. Okay, let's rebuild this bad boy after 10 years, but I'm not really an expert of rebuilding old mopeds, so I call some reinforcements to Mosh, Maribi's brother, and he's an expert in doing this kind of stuff, so Tomasz, welcome to our garage. I'm not an expert, but I know more than you. <laughs> That's for sure. That's enough. And uh, yeah, it's your first time in our vlog, right? Yes. Okay, so... Um, what do you think about this bike? Do you think it's possible? Can we do it? I've seen worse bikes, but I think I can do it. Luckily, we have a donor bike, so actually we can use this one, this moped for spare parts. And come Dominic, we show you the donor bike. Last time was a scooter, this time a moped. So that's our donor moped. And this one we bought with my father to rebuild the other one, but we never did it. So we're gonna use this time this one. And we're gonna make a plan how we do it, right? Let's put it on the table, let's switch the bikes, and let's make a plan. Before we start to wrench the Tomos, we need to pimp the marsh. Let's put some rear rock on clothing on him. Okay. Damn boy, you look fresh. We look like twins now. Hope not. Hope not. <laughs> Hope not. Oh, but we missed something. That's proper rock on style. Welcome to our team now. Yeah. Yeah. Nice. <laughs> you feel used now, right? <laughs> we didn't pay him for to wear this. Okay, finally we can start. What is the first step? What should we do? Take some wrenches and start disassembling this. So let's disassemble the bike and then we go to the step two. So the hammer is the best tool by old bikes. Yeah, especially when everything is rusty. The hammer is the way to go. If the nut doesn't move, get a bigger hammer. That's a customer engine and Dennis is making it as new. So this is a puzzle for bikers. Puzzle for bikers, for big boys. Dennis, which uh, engine are you making new? Uh, 250 KXF. So you are rebuilding it? Yes. Okay. Which bike is this? Kawasaki. Okay, back to work. Okay, okay, put this on the side. We're gonna need this later. West side, man. West side, Yugoslavia. That was outside. When you don't know how to wrench, then you start to argue about what that kind of tools, man. The tools they, are They are fucking rounded. Okay, here's a big, big one. Too big now, man. We have two. Okay, let's see if we have another one. Let me see. This should work. Marsh, what do you say? How old is this bike? 
I don't watch the play. More than me, I think. Okay, who is closer? The one that is closer with the ear pace of beer on the I, lunch break. I think it's you. How old Here. is your wife? I'm gonna say... 87 years. 87 not, years. Not, uh, 87, the I year say... Of production. A year of production, I say... Uh, 82. Okay. You said what? 87. Oh shit. I said 82. Okay, what's the what was the year? 87. <laughs> nah, <No, what? laughs> exactly. I didn't look. I need to pay a beer again. Man, I always lose when I bet something. Don't it's worry, his, how much beer do you already bike. drink? It's his bike, and I know more than him about yeah. his bike. Damn it. <laughs> Dominic, how much beer did you drink already? Um, too much. Too much, eh? I should stop betting, eh? <laughs> I always think I'm gonna win, but I always lose. <laughs> Let's take down the engine now. The holy grail. What are you compensating for? <laughs> compensating for? For a small wrench. Hey, I, a can't, I can't make any pussy jokes because <laughs> I have his sister. <laughs> Same problem here. <laughs> Otherwise you're gonna knock my teeth out. I paid a lot for this teeth, like 3000 bucks, man. Still moving them. Keep this, we need this. Be sure to get all the balls. The one thing I told you not to do. <laughs> he did it. And this doesn't look as fuel anymore. It's more like whiskey. But it's a lot. Like <laughs> for 10 years. The tank's still full. The tank's still full. He's always ready for action. Always ready. Born ready. My bikes need to be ready to ride. Even if they don't work. Parts are here. The moped is disassembled. So, Tomas, what should we do with the parts? Let's see what we can use. What we can't use. Uh, okay, what should we do with the fender? Just some bodywork. And I think it's ready for new paint. Okay, so... But for the color, what should we use? I would, I, I'm yeah. a fan of red, but... It's your moped. Yeah, I would also keep it red stock, but I, I have a suggestion. Let's make it like metallic red with some sparkles in it to make it like new school. So since we are already doing it, so we're gonna be good to me. Let's pimp this moped. Okay, uh, those are the parts. I'm gonna do a list which parts we can reuse and which I need to go buy later. And okay, let's. That's the reason. <laughs> It should be a one part. <laughs> one part, so that's the reason we need to buy some new parts. Okay, let's go to the engine and let's check what we need to do there. That's our 50cc Tomos two-stroke engine and I would like to overhaul it and keep it stock. What do you say to Marsh about this idea? I don't do stock. <laughs> you, do, you don't do <laughs> stock. So we, we need to do something. Some, some stuff. So what do you suggest? Should we tune it a bit or what? If it would be my moped, exhaust, cylinder, bigger carburetor, that's just the beginning. <laughs> okay, <laughs> that's a lot of tuning. You know what? Fuck it. Let's do the whole engine. I think we can make a compromise. Maybe just the exhaust, but we need to do something. No, no. You give me a good idea. Let's stay true to our Rocon garage. Let's change the plan. Let's make this engine like tune it with a big cylinder and maybe my father can do later on some wheelies. Makes me happy. Spare parts list is done, so let's get some spare parts. So our rock is out, getting some parts, we will take a look at the heart of the engine. That's the rock on tech tip. If you are going to rebuild your engine, always look, there is no play in your crankshaft, 
left and right is okay, but there should be no movement up and down. This seems to be fine. Those are spare parts, just stock ones. Some of them we're gonna uh, pimp, like a seat. I'm gonna do a special seat for my father. And now we are checking how we're gonna tune the engine, right? Let's check the parts. The basket is full of tuning parts. Tomorrow selected a lot of parts. So here are the main parts. Bigger engine, bigger carburetor, and a racing exhaust. Bigger, better, stronger. So we're gonna go faster. That's some tough sticker, man. We are preparing the frame and the fenders and so on. I'm, I'm sanding it. What you doing, man? Uh, I'm cleaning the frame so I can sand it later. Okay, so we're gonna prepare the frame for the paint job. And yeah, it's quite a lot of work, so that's really not really the work we like, right? Preparation is key, you can't say anything else. Yeah, you cannot avoid it. Preparation is key, so take a bit more time on it. And yeah, then the paint gonna look really awesome without any mistakes. So let's get to work. Tomos is disassembled. We ordered the spare parts, and we ordered the tuning parts. And that's the thing I want to show you after six months. It's finally here. That's the new Rock-On helmet. You saw it on Aikma when I show you, but this is the final one. So this is the helmet that it's coming on the shelves all around the Europe. So let's see. I'm so super excited. I was, I knew that it's coming, but I didn't know on which day it's finally here. Let's check the new helmet. Oh yeah, check this baby. This time it's a street. Helmet for all the Dukers, for all the Yamaha riders, for all the Honda riders. It has all the hot colors, so it's fitting to all the bikes. And it has my new new style for 2018. The orange color, the blue tiger, the Rockon logos, the same as the sticker kits. And this helmet has also the cool sun visor. It's pretty light, it's really comfortable. I already tried the prototype and yeah, you can buy this beautiful helmet on our online shop. You can find the link below and headlands. Let's give our rockers some helmet porn. Okay. Sick new helmet, right? Guys, give me a second. You see, it's signed. So I'm gonna give away this helmet and all you need to do is find the link below and the lucky guy gonna get the helmet in the next vlog. Okay, man, that was a lot of work today. So we, we already did like a half of the bike, right? We did a lot of work, yes. Okay, uh, so what is the next step now for the next vlog? What can we expect or what can our rockers expect? We need to get the frame from the painter. Okay. We need to get all the parts, tuning parts. Tuning parts? Uh, then we're going to build this engine. It's gonna be faster. Hope you like it. I like this idea. That sounds like a plan. So that's it, guys. So see you in the next vlog. Thanks for subscribing. Thanks for supporting and sharing the vlogs. And see you next week. Until then, rock on. <laughs> okay, let's go eat.